everyone and welcome back to our channel. In this video, we'll make a short overview and a tutorial of basic functions of Zoho CRM. Before we begin this video, please make sure to hit the subscribe button because we prepare a lot of useful content for you. And now let's dive deep into the video. Let's go through the main components of Zoho CRM. First one is your main home screen where you can take a quick look at the progress of your CRM activities and you can easily customize how it looks. Next one in Zoho CRM data is categorized in different modules based on similarity of data. There are some default modules and also you can create a custom module to customize your experience. There are main modules like leads, contacts, accounts and deals. Let's go to the leads module and see what information you can find there. You can view all of your leads and key details about them in your lead list view, like lead name, email, title, company, industry. You can also define which fields are displayed in the list view, and you can find even more information on leads detailed page. You can convert your nurtured leads who show interest in doing business with you into contacts. And you can also associate account and deals when converting your leads into contacts. And you can also create deals and then associate them with accounts and contacts if required. This is how we can build a sales pipeline in Zoho CRM. If you want to get this guided tour through Zoho CRM, you can find a link to that on Zoho website. And now I'll show you some of the settings in the demo CRM account with some more customizations. So here at the home tab, you can see, for example, different types of tasks and you can filter them through your tasks or tomorrow tasks. And you can view all of the other tabs on the home screen and you can add some more tabs to there. You can see that the modules here are customized. There are leads, contacts, and others. And there's also products page where you can list all of your products to manage sales. And there's also services where you can manage and sell services as products in Zoho CRM. There's a lot of custom modules created and you can add even more with one click. And now let's go to the leads tab and see all of the filtering options that can help you to find the records that you're looking for very fast. And then you can save this search in the custom view. In the right corner, you can also see some buttons like create lead, import leads or import notes, and some actions like mass transferring, mass deleting or mass updating of the leads. Now let's go to the contacts page. Contacts module offers the same options for filtering and also some actions that you can do with contacts. And now let's go to the record of one of the clients and see what information you can store there. In Zoho CRM, there are some default fields that are in all of the records of leads or contacts, like contact information, deal associated with this account and others. And there are some also custom fields that you can add or custom widgets that we can develop for you. I have made a video telling about that. You can click the link in the corner or down below in the description box to see what custom widgets we can make for you. Now let's move on to the deals tab. You can see it in classic view or in Kanban view and you can see all of the stages of the deals that are again predefined stages of the deals or you can create your custom stages of the deals in Zoho CRM depending on the products or services that you provide. And now let's talk about the buttons that you can see at the bottom of your screen. There's chats where you can chat with your colleagues, channels and contacts. And on the right side, you can see announcements, motivator and ask Zia, which is a very useful function. This is an AI assistant inbuilt in Zoho CRM that can help you to find information much faster or, for example, create the tasks. There are predefined questions that you can ask Zia or you can ask and type in your own. Now let's click on the motivator icon. Motivator is a very useful tool that can help you to motivate your employees where you can set up KPIs, targets, games, teams, and dashboard. You can find that there and that can help you to achieve goals much faster. There is also another icon of Zia that can help you to find anomalies. There is another icon of the reminders and also the recent items that you can view through these buttons on the bottom of your screen. And now let's go to the setup of Zoho CRM and to the settings. There are general settings like personal or company details, users and control, very useful function where you can set up the roles and access levels depending on the role of your employees, Zoho directory, different channels like emails and socials, 
And the next one is customization. For example, you can customize modules and fields. As I already mentioned, you can add more modules or fields into your records and you can organize and reorganize the fields and modules. Soho CRM is highly customizable. So you can find all of the information much faster and customize the experience of using this CRM depending on the area that you're working in. Now let's move on to another tab in customization, which is templates of emails that you can send directly from Zoho CRM to your leads and contacts. There are some pre-designed templates or you can create your own and you can also customize the pre-designed templates. The email builder is very user-friendly. You can just drag and drop different elements and edit however you like. Next customization option in Zoho CRM is sales pipelines where you can customize different stages of the pipeline and then achieve your sales goal. And the next customization option is Canvas. Canvas is a new feature in Zoho CRM that can help you to optimize the design of your Zoho CRM and make it more visibly pleasant. And that can help you also to find the information much faster. There are also some pre-designed templates of Canvas, and I can also show you how some of those templates can look like. And another customization is the home page. Again, you can fully customize the look of your home page, and I can also show you some of the screenshots of how can it look like when you fully customize this experience. The next tab on the menu is automation, where you can set up different workflow rules, action, assignment rules, and other. Workflow rules are very easy to navigate and to set up. This is a very basic automation. And to have more complicated and complex automations, you can go to process management in settings and set up blueprints, approval processes, review processes, and more. Blueprints are very easy to create in using Zoho CRM. We have made a video on how to create this blueprint you can check it out by the link in the corner or down below in the description box we have a very detailed explanation and i hope that it will be helpful for you now let's talk about the data administration where you can import export data you can also do a data backup which is a very important function not to lose your information there is also storage recycle bin and audit log and a very important thing about Zoho CRM is that it easily integrates with other apps and third-party developer apps. You can go to Marketplace and purchase ready-made integrations with third-party developer apps. We, for example, made extensions connecting Zoho CRM to Shopify, MySQL, BigCommerce and other apps. So you can easily integrate Zoho CRM with your favorite third-party developer apps without any headaches and without spending a lot of time. And if you want to do more advanced customizations or integrations, there is developer space with API, connection functions, widgets, and other things. Because as I already mentioned, this software is very customizable. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that it was helpful for you and help you to understand Zoho CRM and how it works. If it was helpful for you, please leave a comment and make sure to subscribe to our channel and click the notification button not to miss any useful information that we share here every single week.